Brad Pitt and Jason Priestley played game as roommates to see who could go longest without showering. As well as their hygiene issues, the 90,210 actor admitted that he and the Once Upon a Time in Hollywood star only kept beer in the refrigerator of their bachelor apartment. Jason Priestley revealed this week that when he was roommates with Brad Pitt while the two were living in a crappy part of L.A., trying to make it as actors, Pitt could go a long time without showering. The Beverly Hills 90,210 inches star told Kelly Ripa and Mark Consuelos Tuesday he lived with Pitt and another roommate who was an absolute disaster in a two-bedroom apartment at the time. We used to play this game, all of us, to see who could go the longest without showering, Priestley said of their roommate antics. He said he looks back on their behavior now at 54 years old and thinks, dude, how disgusting. What was I thinking? Without hesitation, he told Ripa it was always Brad who won the competition. I don't think he does that anymore, but back then he could go a long time without showering, he joked. When Consuelos asked what was in the 20-somethings refrigerator, Priestley answered laughingly, beer. That's about it. Both Priestley and Pitt quickly found success in the business. Priestley as Brandon Walsh on 90,210, in 1990 and Pitt in 1991's, Thelma and Louise, and, Legends of the Fall, and, Interview with the Vampire, in 1994. Priestley told Rachel Ray in 2019 that he and Pitt remained friends for a long time, and reminisced about when the The Ocean's Eleven actor presented him and some of their other friends with Bibles for Christmas in 1989. And, of course, it was the late 80s. Everyone wanted to be a bad boy, and everyone walked around in their ripped-up jeans with their t-shirts on. Everybody was smoking, and we all thought it was all cool, he explained. He said everyone showed up at their Christmas party with bottles of Jack Daniels and cartons of cigarettes, and it was really cool. And Brad had come back from visiting his family in Missouri, and he brought us all Bibles. He said their names were embossed in them. I mean, they were really nice. I've still got mine. It's at home on my bookshelf. In 2014, Priestley told HLN that he and Pitt never imagined the level of superstardom they'd reach while living together in North Hollywood. We were unemployed actors together, and we all had aspirations to be successful, and obviously that's what you want in your acting career when you're a young actor, he said. The superstardom, the levels of success that we both have had the good fortune to achieve, I don't think that ever came on our radar really because why would it? Because you're really just trying to get your next job when you're that age.